Without language skills, Larry had a life of solitary confinement. Most assumed he had mental retardation and had nothing to say. Then he discovered facilitated communication, assisted typing with a computerized voice. Now he could show that he was the same as everybody else. See this. Larry's sister Sally believes it has transformed his life. It was a rebirth for him when he started typing because then he could get all his thoughts out and express himself. He was silent for over 30 years. Many people with autism are nonverbal. They may communicate by pointing, pacing, walking over to what they want. Even if they are verbal, they don't pick up on social cues. Normally, they don't pick up on other people's body language, facial expressions, so they can't connect to people. It's almost like they're in a country where people speak a foreign language that they don't understand. For Larry, art is language. Good. Through painting, he communicates complex ideas about autism and society. My perspectives on art. My perspectives on art and the idea of eclecticism is what should be implanted in our mass cultural views of autism. We are all differently skilled. We are all differently skilled. Now, cut that out. The thing what Larry's doing is art. He might be saying a lot of things, and then all of a sudden there's this quiet, and there's this real calmness. Larry's art is his self-expression. Larry has been doing art since he's been a, probably five, six years old. Larry found refuge in art when he was misunderstood, misdiagnosed, and locked up in an institution at eight years old it became a form of therapy for him. They said he was severely mentally retarded. In another report, they would say he was schizophrenic. In another report, that he was clinically insane. Larry was physically abused when he was there. Larry has scars on him. He has gone through hell. No more more. When Larry was 20, Sally rescued him from a mental institution. She's cared for him since. Do you want to take your spoon and stir it in there for me? Larry's extremely independent. He helps me prepare a lot of meals. Larry is a working member of our family, like the rest of us. And he's included in everything. Good job. He sets our table. He helps me clean up. And he's very much a very important part of our family. Larry, bring the goulash over to us. Yay! Ready to dig in. And Larry will never, ever, ever be without me. 